Hi friends, welcome to our channel. In the previous session, we had discussed introduction to loops. Now in this session, we will move to the first loop that is while loop. We already know the concept of loop. Loop is to repeat some set of statements multiple number of times based on some condition. Compared to the three loops, while loop, do while and for loop, this is the simplest looping approach. While loop is very simple to implement here while is called entry control loop what do you mean by entry control loop the name specify entry that is before entering into the loop first it text the condition if the condition is true then only the block of statements is executed so here i will show you the syntax first two some initialization is performed after initialization of the variable while inside the bracket we are writing the condition here body of the loop and then update remember we already discussed the four points what are the four points first to before the entering into the loop the first step is initialization after performing initialization, next we are entering into the while loop. The procedure is first to text the condition. So initialization is confirmed. Next to text the condition. If the condition is true, what to do? Execute body, execute the body of the statement. After executing the body of the statement, it perform update operation. Now, what are the points? This is the first step. The checking of the condition is second step. The body of the loop is third step and then update. After updating, what we are doing? Again, check the condition. After updating, again, checks the condition. If the condition is true, again, step three and four are repeated. The process is repeated until the condition is failed. Once we comes out of the loop, we are executing some statement X. After completion of the loop, we are executing some statement X. Suppose I will show you the flowchart, then it is very easy. The first step is initialization. Remember, initialization is performed only one time. Remaining all three things are executed multiple number of times. So what is my next step? Within the diamond box, I am writing the condition. Assume. If the condition is true, what we are doing? We are executing some body of the statement. After executing the body, update. Here, update in the sense, either increment or decrement, depending upon the thing. After updating, what you are doing? After updating, again, we are checking the condition. The same process. See this one. This is a cycle. This is a loop. The same process is repeated. Whenever the condition is fail, then we are comes out of the loop and then execute the next statement. Suppose the statement X is executed. Statement X is executed. Okay. This is the way to implement the while loop. Now I will show you one example, a simple example, the same thing. Print. numbers from 1 to 10 print the numbers from 1 to 10 what is the procedure main int i this is the variable i am declaring what is my first step initialization suppose i is equal to 1 while my condition is the i value is to be printed from 1 to 10. That is the condition is i less than or equal to 10. Inside, I am printing the statement printf percentage d comma i i plus plus. Observe the program. First step, i is equal to 1. This is my initialization. Now, while i less than or equal to 10, that is what happens? 1 less than or equal to 10. The condition is true. If the condition is true, enter into the body. Here, i is equal to 1. 
enter into the body and then print value. So in the answer, one is printed. And then I plus plus. I plus plus means I value becomes 2. He again checks the condition. 2 less than or equal to 10. He again the condition is true. He again enter inside the loop. So inside the loop I value is equal to 2. 2 is printed. I is equal to 3. 3 less than or equal to 10. The same condition is repeated. Suppose I is equal to 10. See carefully. 10 less than or equal to 10. 10 less than or equal to 10. The condition is true. I value 10 is printed on the screen. Now I is equal to 11. 11 less than or equal to 10. The condition fail. We comes out of the loop. Suppose here I am writing some statement printf hello. After printing 1 to 10, hello is printed. This is the way to execute while loop. So in my exercise, in other video, we will discuss some of the programs related to loops. That is the palindrome, Armstrong number, etc. In the next session, we will move to the do while loop. Thank you.